Any interference with the weather today? Yeah, thankfully it doesn't look too bad. We are seeing some clouds across the North Georgia mountains. The further north you are, the more clouds may hinder viewing the eclipse later on today. But those showers you see to our north should stay to our north and it will be nice and toasty outside. So it will be warm. 70 degrees right now in Atlanta, 72 in Cartersville, 71 in Rome. We're going to show you this timeline again because it all starts around 145. That's when we start to see the coverage of the eclipse. Maximum eclipse here will be at about 80 to 85 percent, depending on where you are in North Georgia. That's going to happen around 3:04 p.m. So if you can get outside to view it, I would say between about 3 and 3:10. That's going to be the best timeline for viewing. It will come to an end around 4:21. I'm expecting. Partly cloudy skies, so we will see some off and on clouds as this is happening. It will be warm during the eclipse as well, with temperatures in the mid to even upper 40s. The later it gets, the higher the chance of clouds. So if you want to make sure you get to see it, you may want to start earlier, but the later it gets in the afternoon, we'll start to see some clouds move over the area. Here's a look at the hour by hour timeline. Again, I think optimal viewing between about 3 and 310. Notice looking pretty good across Metro Atlanta, but we do have some clouds around the 3 o'clock hour in the North Georgia mountains. Then by 4 o'clock, we start to see those clouds lift north, and then we will see clouds through the evening with rain chances increasing, but not not until after the eclipse is over. Tonight we'll see clouds and just a few spotty showers as temperatures drop to 60 degrees. Tomorrow we'll see some morning rain and then it stays pretty cloudy, but it will be warm with highs in the 70s. Rain chances start to increase tomorrow. Tomorrow is a first alert weather day, especially for the morning commute. Plan on some wet weather, then we'll get a break. But then as we head into Tuesday evening, we'll see more showers in the mountains through the metro. On Wednesday, it will be cloudy. It looks like most of the day Wednesday's dry, but Wednesday evening, those rain chances increase through very early Thursday. So we do have three first alert weather days. Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. We'll be watching for some storms Wednesday into Thursday morning. Far West Georgia under a level one threat of severe weather. So an isolated risk of severe weather as these rain chances move in. It's going to stay rather unsettled starting tomorrow through Thursday, but we do have a beautiful weekend ahead. Here's a look at Atlanta's most accurate seven day forecast. Some morning showers Tuesday with storms late Wednesday into Thursday and beautiful weather just in time for the weekend. All right.